اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم In this session, we are going to look into how to automatically find DOI or Digital Object Identifiers. Now recently, I was writing a paper and I was asked by the journal to provide a DOI for all the references in the list. Now I had around 100 references. Now finding DOI values one by one for each one of the reference obviously is a very difficult task. So what you can do is you can come to this simple text query in a cross reference and you can paste all your references in and then it will provide you with all the DUI values. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this paper that I'm working on and I'm going to copy the references from here which do not have any DUI values. Let's say I copy quite a few of them. Let's say this is a book. Obviously, uh, if the book has DUI, then you will get it. Otherwise, there won't be any DUI. So let's say I've copied quite a few of them. Let, let me copy all of them. Here it is. So I've copied all my references and I'm going to put them here. Now, here are a few instructions. There should be no line breaks with an individual reference. When submitting multiple references, they must be in alphabetical order or presented in a numbered list. To check the accuracy of a reference, click on the link that is returned with the reference. You may use reference style, although it works best if references are formative, formatted in a consistent and standard style. Just cut and paste this example list to try it out. Now you can copy this list and it will give you the DUI values. Now for now, I'm just going to click submit. Please check list all possible DUIs per reference and submit. Now here is my reference list with the DOI values here, all of them. Now for this one, obviously it didn't find, so it did not provide any reference. What I'm going to do is I'm going to copy these, copy, and I'm going to paste it here. First, let's see if it did give me all the references. So 39 references I've got here. And let's say if I've got 39, paste, and then you can number them to find out if you've got 39 references. So this is how you can use the simple text query. Let's see if got, here it is, one. So these are blank spaces, they need to be removed. And obviously, then you will have your 39 references. So this is an easy way to find all the possible DOI values when asked by a journal. Thank you very much.